You know, for a while, I gotta be honest, that for a long time I was considering um, becoming a Buddhist. Um, but then I read uh, that Buddha left his wife and baby to seek enlightenment. Oh my God. <laughs> Buddha's a deadbeat dad. <laughs> I mean, that's why you only hear about the second coming of Christ. Buddha ain't coming. <laughs> He'd have to pay 1,500 years worth of that child support. He ain't coming. <laughs> now, you know, I'm not a, a, a very religious person, but it really bothers me when I sneeze and people don't say, God bless you. That bothers me. Because, you know, the theory back in the day was that when you sneeze, an evil spirit enters your body. Saying, God bless you, drives it out. Now, I know that's just a superstition, but I don't want to take no chances. <laughs> I don't want to be like, <laughs> catch a cold, need an exorcism. That ain't right. <laughs> but man, I gotta tell you guys, I love my job. I think this is the best job in the whole world. Cause you know what, before this, I used to work at a bookstore, which was great except for the customers. You know, asking me questions when I'm trying to read, excuse me. <laughs> you know, this woman came in my store one time, said she was looking for a book, but could not remember the author or the title. <laughs> but said the cover was blue. <laughs> I was like, oh yeah, I know that book. We sold out. <laughs> Yeah, I was like, try back on Friday. <laughs> I quit on Thursday. <laughs> I do love to read, though. I really do. You know what I'm saying? If books were illegal, you guys, I'd be in jail. And I'd have to get all hardcore about it, too. You know, get a tattoo of my favorite book, Harry Potter. What, what? <laughs> love Harry Potter. You know, I am surprised, though. Sometimes I meet people who are not fans of the book, which surprises me. I was reading the first book, and this woman came up to me, kind of got in my face. She was like, you know, Harry Potter is a plot to corrupt children into believing in magic and worshiping the devil. I was like, whoa, somebody needs to cut back on her caffeine. <laughs> because that's a little crazy to me, because when I was a little kid, I didn't read Alice in Wonderland, think I was gonna fall down a rabbit hole, meet an invisible talking cat, right? You don't get that from reading a book. You get that from dropping acid. <laughs> I actually try to look on the bright side. You know, a few kids read Harry Potter, start worshiping the devil. At least they're reading. Because I think the last thing we want is an illiterate disciple of Satan, don't you think? You know, I was, I was actually sharing that story with someone recently, and she actually said to me, she goes, oh my God, Leanne, you read Harry Potter? How white are you? I guess the next time I'm pulled over by the police, I can go, it's okay, officer. I read Harry Potter. <laughs> and I was really confused by the question because I wasn't sure if she was trying to imply that black people don't read or that we don't read Harry Potter. Because <laughs> I didn't ask one of my white friends to go buy the book for me with the money I earned picking cotton. That's not what happened. <laughs> For some people, it's not enough that I am black. I have to act black too, which is kind of weird, because honestly, I, I thought Eminem was acting black enough for all of us. <laughs> but I gotta tell you, I, I, I really, I really have enjoyed being here, and I love what I do. I just want to ask you guys to do me a little favor. If you've enjoyed me this evening, can you please remember me so that I'm not just famous in my own mind? <laughs> I'm serious. Um, so, no, well, no, I'll, I'll tell you my name again so it sounds familiar. It's Leanne Lord. Yeah, Lord L-O-R-D. That's a wonderful name to have, isn't it? Because right off the bat, you know, I got connections. <laughs> Whenever anybody tries to mess with me, I'm like, excuse me? My name is Leanne Lord. I think you know my father. <laughs> you guys, thank you so much. I'm Leanne Lord. Leanne Lord, oh, you'll remember.